okay so let's do this one now okay uh, so just just all of you read this problem suppose a consumer has a utility function of the form ux plus y Uh, good X is a discrete good, and there are only two possible consumption levels. X is zero and X is one. Okay, uh, you can assume that U zero is zero. Okay, uh, suppose price of X is less than or equal to M. So what that means is basically you can afford one unit of X. You know, this condition says that you can afford one unit of X. Okay. Uh, so the question is, uh, you know, consumer will choose X equal to one under what condition? So how will you do this problem? So is the goods or perfect substitute? Okay. You don't need to apply any rule. You know, I mean, if you just think about it, there are only two choices. Either you choose zero units of X or you choose one unit of X. Do you agree there are only one cho two choices? Either you choose zero units of X or you choose one unit of X. Yes. So you just compare the utilities. What is a satisfaction level associated with zero units of X? Well, if you choose zero units of x, your utility will be u0 plus y. Okay, and uh, uh, so income is m. Okay, and py is the price of y. Okay, uh, so basically, what you're going to get is m by py. Right? Yes or no? Because u0 is 0. And you'll spend all your money on Y. You can buy M by P by units of Y. So you, your utility will be U0 plus M by P Y. And since U0 is zero, so the utility is M by P Y. Do you agree? And if you buy one unit of X, your utility will be U1. So obviously you have already bought one unit of X. So how much, how much money you are left with? M minus PX. M minus PX. M minus. Okay, you're left with this much money and you spend this much money on Y. Do you agree that's your utility? So this has to be greater than whatever it utility. It has to be uh, greater than this. That's it. Okay, so you're going to get what? U1 plus M minus PX upon PY should be bigger than m by py okay now you can just cancel m by py and you will get u1 should be bigger than px by py which would mean that px should be less than p by u1. one times p that's it 